Hey my dogs, it's Simon here. Welcome back to the Hermit's Cave. I hope everybody is having a good week. I've not been on since the weekend. I think when I did my live on Sunday, I mentioned that I was back at work this week and it's pretty full on um, and we're already at Thursday. <laughs> and yeah, this is the first opportunity I've had to come on. But what I wanted to talk about and you'll see from the title, it's about a very, I'm not going to say cheap, because this product isn't cheap, uh, but very affordable um, tarot deck. And we're living in times at the moment where, you know, particularly in the UK, the cost of living is going up through the roof. Um, fuel prices and energy prices and everything else. And if you're a tarot collector, You'll have also seen that tarot decks are also seem to be getting more and more expensive. There was one I was looking at the other day that I like the look of, and I went online, I went to the shop, and it was eighty pounds for. And I'm not talking dollars; that's probably around a hundred dollars, ninety-five, hundred dollars, eighty pound for a tarot deck, and I can't do it. You know, um, as somebody who um, doesn't have I mean, I think I might have lit too much incense with having my <laughs> my backflow burner and uh, the incense stick. So I'm going to move that. Um, otherwise, yeah, I might start choking. Um, yeah, somebody who doesn't, you know, have much of a social life, doesn't drink, doesn't smoke. Um, even I feel the pinch when we look at um, the prices of things that are classed as our likes and dislikes, our hobbies, our interests, um, when we have to look at the, the everyday stuff that we need to make sure we've got money in the bank for, then things like tarot decks um, probably have to be uh, considered more carefully. However, I wanted to let you know about a tarot deck that is available on um, on Amazon. I'm sure other places as well. Um, and I want to talk a little bit about the origin of this deck because this is a good quality deck for less than £10. Um, a few years ago, and probably going back possibly even three, over three years ago, um, there was a tarot deck that was on the market, which is this one. Uh, no, it's not, sorry, I'm showing you the wrong one, in wrong order. This one, and it was called the Original Tarot Deck of 78 Cards. Notice the similarity here. Both showing the Wheel of Fortune, both similar colours, both the same kind of border, wording, etc. Now, on the back of this one, um, it says it's by Siren Imports, okay? Often referred to as the Debris. Uh, debris or debris, however you want to uh, to pronounce that. And this was a really nice um, deck and it says on the back, um, the original design tarot deck has been originally made by Pamela Coleman Smith under the instruction of Arthur Edward Waite. We have digitized the card graphics to bring you crisp vectorized images on quality card paper with linen finish. And this is a really, really uh, nice deck. These are the ones that have the kind of cappuccino colored backs with this nice design um, in the center and the border that you get on the box. It also came with a little book called Key to the Tarot. And for the majors, you got color images. And this is a nice, little book it has some spreads at the beginning um and information um you don't get as much for the minors but that's, that's quite standard but really nice a little book um the card linen is quality as well i don't know if it will pick up it should do yes it's picking up you can see it's a nice sturdy but flexible deck really really good quality and as it said digitally restored, vectorized, and really, really crisp. And I talked about it quite a bit 
back in 2019, I believe it was. The colours are vibrant, maybe a bit too vibrant for some people. So that is that one. Let's put that there for a second with the box. Because then a few months later, we had this one, which drops off the debris, but it still says Siren Imports. And I believe this is the one that Jen Phoenix used from Jen's Balanced Tarot for Tarot Playdate, I believe. Again, it is luxury linen, is very little difference. Um, if anything other than um, some colour changes, the yellow is the same, the tunics. But as you can see on the ground here, we've got little bits of grassy green. The boots are green instead of yellow. This one is more red. So you can see um, some colour differences. And these, these ones had this tan coloured background, a light tan with the design. Um, is the same, same design, but the colours have been reversed, okay? Um, the little white book was replaced by a very naff pamphlet, a little, little pamphlet. But a lot of people preferred the colours of this one. Again, it didn't seem as bright, the blues weren't as deep. It was a little bit lighter, the colour tones were, but it's still very crisp and very clear. And both of these decks were about 16, 17 pounds, okay? So the lovely Navneet over at the Wandering Star um, channel, do check her out if you haven't already, uh, been a subscriber and supporter of my channel for many years did uh, oh this one is a little bit thicker as well no it's not yes it is it's a little bit thicker because um maybe it's because it was on that pamphlet yeah no they're the same thickness ignore me it's because it's sitting on on top of the pamphlet um yeah the lovely navni um, ordered this deck thinking she was going to get the one that said tarot deck. Okay. And I think she said it even advertised it as saying tarot deck. And it does. But when it comes now, it just says tarot. But it still says deck of 78 cards, like it does on these. So we've gone from the original tarot to tarot deck, which is just tarot. Okay. Deck of 78 cards, similar design. In fact, it's the same design in terms of border. So these are made by the same people. It's clear it's made by the same people. This one says Siren Imports Debris. This one just says Siren Imports. This one doesn't say anything anywhere about the publisher. But notice the backs. Okay. Using the same four cards, we have the four, the Magician, and our Empress, Full Magician Empress, and the reverse. Same design, more or less on the back, same, same colors, same border, but the, uh, you know, this is like a Star of David, whereas this is like, um, what do they call that? Flower of Life type design. Now, where does it say Siren Imports or Debris? But what this deck has done, now this retails for 9.99, which is a great price. We have gone back to the colour book. It is different because on the front, it still says the key to the tarot, but we get the Wheel of Fortune card here based on the pictorial key to the tarot, based on the pictorial key to the tarot. That one says by Arthur Edward Waite. And it credits Brian Wenger here, okay? But it's the same little book. I'll even have the uh, three card spread there. So it's exactly the same as this original one with the brown uh, backs and the tan colour design. We've kept the light colour of the second one, but the, as I mentioned, 
there's a change with the design, okay? But it's got exactly the same border, same coloration and everything. The difference is this one doesn't have linen. It doesn't have a linen finish. Now, if you're used to ordering decks off MPC, um, I would describe this as their superior smooth. The cardstock is really, really good. It's a lovely cardstock. Again, what they credit themselves being responsible for is taking the artwork of Pamela Coleman Smith and digitizing it, their word, um, and vectorizing it and making it really, really sharp. And I've got to say, you, you, we've even got, you know, Pix's um, font, Pix's calligraphy. Wow, there's a lot of smoke coming from this little poppet. <laughs> um, what I like about it, though, is we don't have any um, trademarks, copyrights, I should say, trademarks, copyrights on uh, the borders. This is a beautiful, beautiful deck. And if you are starting out learning the tarot and you want to learn with a RWS, a Rider Waite Smith system for $9.99, which that's pretty much what I paid this morning for two coffees at Starbucks uh, for me and a friend, you can get a good quality RWS tarot deck. That is actually really beautiful. I'm really impressed with it. I think I prefer this version to the linen version. The colours seem very, very bright, but not gaudy. You know, the blues aren't too blue. Um, and because of the sharpness, I mean, look at the pink in that rainbow. Oh, and look at the page of cups. Absolutely gorgeous. For $9.99. And this is a thick deck. I would imagine it's the same sort of thickness as the, the other two. But we will we'll have a quick look. Actually, it could be thicker. Let's just try and do this... Uh, It's a little bit, a little bit thicker. The cardstock is really nice. I do like these, but I think sometimes, and it's not going to show uh, on here, sometimes the, because the linen cardstock is quite, and the blue is really blue, because the linen cardstock is quite textured, sometimes with some of the faces, if the light's shining on it, um, there is a bit of a pattern, whereas with this smooth cardstock, it's less so. So I just wanted to, to pop on. It's a little bit of a mystery because clearly these are made by the same people, but they're now choosing not to put their name to it. Um, there will be probably people saying, well, you know, maybe these are bootlegs. Bootleg decks don't tend to give you um, the quality that these do. And believe you me, I've fallen prey uh, to a few scams in my time buying tarot decks. As you'd imagine with somebody with over 700 decks, there's been many times that I've bought a deck and, you know, it's been a bootleg and they've gone in the bin because I don't want them and I don't want them out there in the world as well. Yeah, there's quite a pattern on this. So sometimes when you look at it, um, the pattern of the um, of the linen finish gets in the way a little bit just in my opinion I'm going to end up putting the wrong that belongs to that one with the original so I wanted to pop on because if you just go to Amazon and you type in tarot deck this is one of the first that comes up 
Um, and I guess it's probably potluck because they are still advertising it as the, this box, which says tarot deck. But what you actually get, and this was the same with Navni, she was like, how come it just says tarot? The picture that I've ordered says tarot deck. It's the same, it's the same deck, um, I'm convinced, by the same company. Um, but you're not going to get linen and, but what you are going to get is we've gone back to this really nice little little white book. So, as I said, $9.99. It's not going to break the bank. Um, if you want an RWS, trust it, because if I go on Amazon and I see $9.99, it's going to be rubbish. The paper quality is going to be appalling. The print finish is going to be appalling. Um, maybe it's just got a fold out. Actually, it's a really good price and it's a really good quality deck. So much so that this might just stay out, you know. I don't, I don't mind for $9.99 whether this gets really dinged up uh, by using it a lot. Um, but yeah, so I just wanted to pop on really, just a quick one today, just to uh, make you aware of this deck. If you're not already aware of it, maybe you are, maybe you've ordered it, but if you're apprehensive about what you're gonna get, for $9.99, what I can tell you is you're going to get a good quality uh, deck. All right, everyone, thank you for watching. If I'm not back already at Thursday, so it's very unlikely. If I'm not back before Saturday, I'll be here 7 p.m. Um, and what we're going to talk about is this deck, Tarot Original 1909. I finally got round to getting this. I got the original in the top box and then I've got the round circular deck, the round circular, that's a tautology, isn't it? The circular deck, but I really wanted this version. It's taken a while to get back on Amazon because I wanted to take a look at the book that comes with it by Sasha Graham. So we'll have a look at that on, on Saturday. Thanks for watching everybody. Until next time, go in peace. Namaste and blessed be.